a comic car. I was called in to a meeting uh, at ITV and they said, well, they wanted a big budget show that could have elements of horror and fantasy and action and adventure. It's a guy with an alter ego. He, when he, he can turn into someone else and nobody knows it's him and he can do all the things that he dreams about doing when he's a normal person. Thanks for waking me up. Some of the lines I get to say are just magic. Um, and they're really fun. They're sort of, they're still sort of scary and uh, exciting, but at the same time they have got the tongue-in-cheek that Charlie brings to it. It was about a guy in contemporary London fighting with his own demons, and it still feels a very modern story. We all have this thing where we have these dark urges and dark desires, and we keep them, we keep them repressed, but they have a way of coming out. There's something big coming, and we need to be ready. We didn't want Hyde to be the kind of horrible monster with fangs and mad hair. We wanted Hyde to be the guy that we all think we are. So he's sexy, he's good looking, he's dangerous, uh, he's a really good fighter. Uh, he's invulnerable, he's super fast and he can regenerate quickly. All the things we all wish we could do. So we had to find someone who could convincingly be Jekyll where he's a bit more kind of uh, traditional sort of repressed Englishman and then hide when it's all hanging out. I wouldn't miss this for the world.